Hey y'all. Hey Facebook. Hi Instagram. Hi Instagram. Going live on all hitting live on all the platforms. Let's see. Let's see. Come on in. Come on in. I'm on Instagram. I'm on Facebook. I'm trying to go live on Amazon.com. If you want to join us on Amazon.com, all you have to do is go to the link in our bio and on Instagram, swipe up when you see the Amazon link and you can join us live on Amazon. So welcome, welcome, welcome everyone. If you're joining me for the first time, my name is Tara Darnley. I'm the founder of Peculiar Roots, where we make amazing build free products for your locks. And I know my locks are covered now, but I'll show you um, just in a bit because I've been rocking a protective style. We're going to be talking about a lot of protective style, especially for my starter lockers tonight. And I'm going to be showing you a demo. You are going to show you a demo of how to wash your starter locks, but our guest doesn't need to wash. <laughs> she honestly doesn't need to wash. And we're going to dive into um, starter locks, how to maintain them. And a lot of the times we're told a lot of different myths and things about starter locks. And so I want to show you what routine she's using and how she's able to maintain her starter locks. So as you're joining, all I would like for you to do is just drop in the comment section where you're tuning in from, your name, if this is your first time joining, so I could properly greet you. If you are catching a replay, you can also uh, put in the comment section where you're joining us from. If you're on Amazon, make sure you hit that follow button. And again, if you do want to join us on Amazon, all you have to do is go to our IG, swipe up, and the link is so you could join us live on Amazon where you could see some of the actual products that I'll be talking about tonight. Um, and I'm going to like kind of just maneuver my tools. I could see your comments tonight. <laughs> uh, why, why be like they on Thursday? I got a call from my peeps in Peculiar Roots. Yes. And if you're new, make sure Thursdays, you just block off Thursdays at six o'clock just for us. Like block Thursdays off just for us. Like don't make no dinner plans, no bay. Like, you know, it's just us, me, you together. That's our date right so commit to your date with me just like i'm committed to my date with you so i love that thanks you thanks for joining illinois in the building Treka, Treka. am i pronouncing your name right Treka. i always feel like i mess up your name um Treka from illinois charlotte's in the house uh, first time order today yay we're in Greensboro, so that's awesome. Welcome to the tribe. Um, we have Leah is on Amazon. So if you're on Amazon, let me know in the comment section who's joining. Hey, Stacy. All right, we're going to jump into it. So I'm going to just take off my bonnet. And this bonnet is actually available on our site. Um, I think they're on Amazon as well. And as you can see, it holds all of my hair. I've literally been rocking this protective style all week. Um, and I'm going to show you what I did to my hair. I did my wash day on Sunday. And I retwist my hair. <laughs> Y'all know your girl be waiting months to retwist her hair. Um, yes, I said it right. Great. Um, I'll be waiting months to retwist my hair, but I did it, y'all. And you know when you retwist your hair, like nobody can't tell you. Like, just don't talk to me for a good solid two days after I do my retwist, because you know I'm a brand new person and it took a lot for me to do it, especially I'm doing it myself. So just don't talk to me for a good two days. Anybody else feels like that on your new retwist day? <laughs> like you're just a whole brand new human being. And so that's what I did. But I just kind of switched up a little bit. And I'll show you guys. I have my bonnet on and I kind of like tied down my edges. And I'll show you our bonnets have satin lines. So I wasn't worried about like anything happening to my hair. And what I did was I wash with our charcoal shampoo and our ACV shampoo and then I refresh my hair. I actually tried the pomegranate spray this time and I did the kiwi oil um, to seal in all that moisture and then I did some braids. As you could see I just took like a few of my locks. I only use a pomade on my edges. Took a few of my locks. I braided them and then at the end, I tied it in a knot. So that's where I got like this semi cute style from. So look, I just tied the end in a knot like that instead of like the whole thing. And so like I have like my kids, my kid was saying I had like balls at the end of my hair, <laughs> but 
I'll pull them to the front so you guys can see. Like I had a little balls and then in my hair. I thought it was cute. And I had this all week, y'all. And they look fresh. They look brand new. Like, look at my little balls. Some of them are still intact. Some of them I probably just have to, you know, reball. <laughs> I have to reball. Hey, Pammy. Um, I have to reball some of them. So I just tie a knot and I tuck. Right? And I just pull it a little bit. That's good. That's good. That's good. This one I'll do. <laughs> I'll do. Hey, Donnelly on YouTube. Thanks for joining us on YouTube, girl. Did the balls make you? Nope. They don't feel heavy at all. Like my hair doesn't, my hair doesn't feel heavy. I have a lot of hair, but it doesn't feel heavy. And I'm not sure in all honesty, I'm not sure if that's because I'm just used to it by now. Um, but it doesn't, my hair doesn't feel heavy. If it did, I would have been <laughs> trimmed it or something. So this is my protective style. And all week, all I have to do, hi, Lydia, is just spray. So from roots to end, just like that. Oh, God, it smells so good. This is on Amazon. And this is our pomegranate pear. I'm going to pull that up on Amazon so you guys could add that to your cart if you want to. If you click that link, we have seven different scents. All amazing. Oh, yes. So that's it. I'm not going to oil my hair. And literally, that's all I did all week. And then I put it back under that bonnet. That's it. Because this weekend, I have an event. I'm going to remove these um, on the weekend so I can have some nice curl. Look at my unballed. All right. <laughs> but tonight, we're talking all about starter locks and how you should maintain them, right? Let me take myself down. Starter lock journey expectation. Thank you, Tawana. You better come through with the graphics, girl, because your girl did not remember what the topic line was. <laughs> but starter locks, how you should maintain them. So we actually have a new starter lock person that we welcome to our family. Did we welcome her? Did we welcome her, y'all? We're going to see. But we have a new starter lock family that we welcome to our family. And she's actually on our team. She actually packs your goods all day and no wonder she decided to get locks again this is actually her second set of locks this is her second set of locks so she's not new to this but she decided to come back over to the lock world because she's i mean she's seen y'all all day <laughs> she's packing your ish all day and she was using peculiar roots before she got locks she's been enjoying the products and so she decided to get locks and so serima has been locks for lock for four weeks right now we've actually been kind of really like documenting her journey she's exclusively using peculiar roots and so tonight we actually had planned to do a wash day which we're gonna probably bump up she want to bump it up to another two weeks because she thinks she could go another two weeks six weeks um without getting washed and show you her scalp because that's really important and I want her to talk to you guys about how her hair is feeling and all that good stuff and what her routine is right so everybody drum roll <laughs> Let's welcome to the stage, Serima. <laughs> Let's show her some love in the comment section. This is Serima. She's wearing a shirt that says Queen of Everything. That be me. She really acts like that in real life. So, so come over here. I'm going to try to be nice to you while we're live. <laughs> Rima the Dreamer. <laughs> I love it. Rima the Dreamer. Everybody, Everybody say hi, hi to hi, Rima. Hi. Hi. Rima. Yay! And if you've gotten, if you've ordered from us, most of the time you'll see this lovely person's signature because she wants to be fancy. She got a stamp and shit. So you'll see her stamp. Like, it's me. It's me that packed it. Like, like girl. And enjoy. Who cares? Like, who Do y'all care that she packed y'all order? Yeah, they do. <laughs> So Serima's here. Spana. Look at and she gave me permission to touch her locks. Yeah, I don't like anybody just touching yes. my hair. And we are big on that. We give each other permission. So even when she wants to touch my locks, she asks me first. And to this day, we still do that. Like Tawana, can I touch your hair? Sure. We don't ask Tawana. We just touch it. <laughs> Look at them. They're like, we care. We care. Whatever. Hey. <laughs> So we do ask permission to touch each other locks. I will say that's Stacey, the first time. Okay, stop saying hi. She thinks she's celebrity now. Um, <laughs> so we do that. Would you say that's the biggest tip you will tell people? Like if you are starting your 
journey to be clear on expectation of others in your space and you're here um, by asking you permission to touch your locks. Absolutely. So I always ask her, even when she came, I was like, can I touch it? And that's only because she did it herself and I wanted to make sure she ain't afloat. Um, <laughs> but I'm going to, you're going to do a 360 turn. So one thing I want you guys to notice with her crown is it's she's letting it do what it wants to do. And she works in an environment. She works in an amazing workplace where she can do whatever the hell she wants with her locks. We actually embrace locks. But thank you. But we know <laughs> we know not everybody has the opportunity, right? So we're going to also show you some protective styles that you can kind of do if you're in the workplace. But she can like literally do whatever. And so she comes to work and she kind of lets her hair just do this thing right now. And it's been doing this thing. So this is after four weeks. I want you guys to just take a look, right? You're going to do a 360 turn, right? It's just coming in beautifully. It's already button. And what I mean by button, if you have starter locks, you'll see your hair starts taking, <laughs> you'll see your hair starts taking different forms. It may have like a bump. It's not abnormal. There's nothing wrong with your hair. That's natural. And as we're going, please feel free to drop your questions in the comment section. But this is what her hair looks like. And she's actually doing the crochet method. So she's been kind of cheating the process in a way. She's doing the crochet to help it lock faster because of her hair texture. Um, we advise that if you're going to do that route, use a professional. But Surima has done some careful research. And this is what's been working for her. And so as you can see, it's like, button. it's like, I like that it's really uniform already. And it's just nice. She gave it a big enough part where it's not too small and it's not too big. Right. And. And I want you to actually get up, Serena, if you don't mind, because I really want them to see your scalp. I think it's so important that you guys see how healthy her scalp is. I see our scalp crushing over here, if that's a thing, because for a starter locker, what is this? Oh, we scalp crushing. Lord, help us. This is how y'all act when y'all get locks. What is this? <laughs> but... Um, can you guys see her scalp on Amazon? I know you can come over slightly over here for Instagram. You guys, there is no like buildup. There's no dandruff. Her scalp is right here. <laughs> her scalp is just clean as she's embracing her little, look at her little gray. They look so cute. Oh girl. <laughs> <laughs> they look cute, but she's embracing her like everything. And I love like literally, and I wish I had like a magnifying glass. Like her scalp is so perfect, like right? Before we got on here, I was like, I know it's your watch day, but I think you should wait a little bit because I really want her here to bud in peace, do its thing in peace without tampering with it. And so a lot of the times you may have a seat. <laughs> a lot of the times um, I have to put a nose next to my stash. <laughs> a lot of the times um, when you start your locks, some of the things that you're told is not to wash your locks and if you are just in your lock journey or before, let's all go back to our first time starting our locks. How long were you told? Let me know in the comment section. How long were you told not to wash your locks? In the comment section, let me know. If you're just joining, we're talking about starter lock here. In the comment section right now, tell me when you started your locks, whether it was with a professional or you just hearing certain things, how long were you told not to wash your hair? I, over a decade ago when I started, I was told not to wash my hair for six months. Six months. And I think it was last week someone else told us that. Last week in the year 2021, someone told us that her loctician told her not to wash her hair um, until after six months as well. So it's still going on. Uh, Marie said a month to two months. That's okay. That's um, funny when it's a year and six months or something. I like was told months. three to four weeks. That's good. And Jazz, you're, you're in good hands. We could tell by how your hair is looking. Um, sister locks, so I had to wait four weeks. Sister locks, four weeks is perfect. I was told don't wash for two to three months. Hi, Stacy. Um, so we're here in about roughly four weeks, which is the same as a month, which to us, I consider that good. Four to six weeks is okay. You can even push it to two months, honestly, if you're using built-up free products and you're not having a lot of issues having, um, happening with your hair. Your day-to-day -day activity is not a lot where you're sweating and you're seeing like different stuff in your hair. I would say one to two months, okay. Maybe when you're going into three months to six months, no, don't do it to yourself. Don't do it to yourself. 
Do not wait that long. You don't have to. And I've seen a lot of people saying that's the fastest way your hair is going to lock. Your hair is going to lock with dirt. That's nasty. That's like telling somebody don't bathe because you're going to smell good when you go outside. That's funky. That's nasty. So don't do that. I mean, we know in 2021 it's a thing. <laughs> We've been here and it's a thing not to bathe. But I'm telling you guys, you can wait tw uh, one month to two months. That's okay. Um, I believe I had to start washing earlier. My hair would be more mature. I'm 14 months now, I'm shaking my head. Jasmine, how? when did you start washing it, mama? Um, I was told not to wait to wash my locks. My lock styles is a license. Yes, good. And that also goes back to, if you're using a professional, vet them properly. Ask questions. Like, honestly, if somebody's telling you six months, that's already a red flag. Like, they, they're just, like, regurgitating shit they hear online, and it's not, did I say shit? They're regurgitating <laughs> things <laughs> that they hear online, and it's not Dolly. okay. Give uh, Dolly says shit. Shut up. <laughs> so don't do that. Um, um, Donnelly said she started her locks herself, but she was also told not to wash until six months. Donnelly, um, nice. I started my. Hers? Yeah, it's really nice. Looks and nice. Pam does her hair now, too. Oh. Um, I started um, my own, so I waited Pam. six to eight weeks. I didn't know about the wave cap and wash back then. You're still good. That's a good enough time. And I heard that, like, hey, you got to use a wave cap and all that stuff. Honestly, you don't. Um, I didn't with Lee's hair, and when I do wash Serena's hair, I'm not going to use one. I'm going to show you guys. You don't have to use one. You just have to wash in a specific way. You're not going to do this. Can I? Like, you're, I'm not going to do it to unravel her hair, right? <laughs> um, come closer. It's not I'm not going to buy it. <laughs> so this is what her hair looks like now after... Only four weeks, it's healthy, it's not itching, and I'm gonna allow Sarima to go ahead and tell you guys what she's been doing over the last four weeks, why her hair turned out like this. Because I'm not in her, you know, in her room every morning figuring out what she's doing, so she's gonna tell y'all what she's doing. I'm a lot of mess up. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. Okay. Every morning, well, the last time when I before I started the locks, I actually washed my hair with my lemon shampoo bar and I moisturized and I conditioned my hair with the rose conditioner. Then every morning. Wait, you started to condition your hair already? Well, before I put the locks in. Okay. I'm saying before my last wash. So clarify that because the we last don't recommend wash. conditioning. Okay, the last wash before I actually started this, I washed with the lemon shampoo bar mm -hmm. and I conditioned with the rose conditioner. Um, but every day my my mantra every morning is my pineapple refresher spray. Right now I'm doing cherry blossom. And I use my growth serum and just a little dots and rub it through the hair every morning and then um my oil and that's it i use my oil my refresher spray first i refresh my hair first and then i put the serum and then i put the oil last i just put a little like a i'd say i put a nickel size of the oil and rub it together and just you know all through the hair that's enough for the whole head back everything and my hair actually stays very moist the only time i use my pomade is when I want to smooth my edges down, like if I'm putting a band around the hair or something. And then I'll use a little fingertip and just put it in there. But this been what, like you said, three four, weeks, four, four weeks, weeks. no wash. And it's absolutely wonderful. And the refresher spray keeps it really fresh and smelling good. How much time you touch your hair a day? This is the most I touch my hair. Oh, I don't touch my hair this much at all. Um, I just leave it. Actually, it looks like this. She said to me the other day, they asked me, what, what's going on with your hair? Because I came in the other day and there was a piece sticking up <laughs> like this and there was another piece back here that just didn't want to lay down. And I told her, I just roll out of my bed and do whatever I do, shake it and come to work. How it falls is how it falls. And I'm just going to leave it and let it do its thing like that. And I'm in the awkward stages right now. So, And what I love about what you're saying is, so one, first of all, uh, she's consistent with, with, with a routine. Whatever yeah. that routine is for you, she has been consistent. Yes. So consistency is key, right? You can't start something and then decide I'm bored or I'm tired or I'm going to forget about it and just let it go. Like start a routine and stick to it, right? And then the second thing she said um, was, I'm just letting it be, whatever form. So sometimes you guys will see one lock because we always have that one lock. 
<laughs> that sticks. Look at that one sticking out. It's you always had that one lock that <laughs> sticks yeah. out. But sometimes we want to like, oh, I need a, I need a gel to not make my locks move. I need this. I need that. Like, no, no. you don't. Like, your hair is forming. It's taking off, trying to find its personality. Your hair has, your locks has a personality. That's why there's no lock that is same. Like, her locks is not going to be about like mine and vice versa. Her locks is not going to be like Tawana. It's going to be its own unique form of locks. It's going to be its own peculiar your roots, right? And so allow your hair to take on the form it's going to take on and just leave it. Um, your nephew's on and said, big up auntie. Big up B. <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> um, It's not uh, Mrs. Locks of Love. That is not a qu crazy question. And please, when we do Locked and Loaded Live, there's no stupid question. There's no crazy question. We're here to answer all your questions. Um, she's asking, how does she use the, the, um, the shampoo bar? And also, if you bought our products and you're not sure, feel free to check out our IG. I've pretty much done, done a tutorial on everything. So this is how they come. It's actually in a plastic. So you're going to move this plastic. Sometimes it has some decoration of some dry leaves. You can remove that too. Um, but you're going to literally take it like this. And you're just going to rub in a circular motion once your hair is wet. It's going to start lathering. So just like you would, like the shampoo, the regular liquid shampoo, you pour in your hands and rub. This one, you're just going to rub directly on your hair. And then you're going to start massaging. You can use our Ooh. shampoo bar. Oh, you can show them. That smells good, no. Which one is that? Olive. Oh, I smelled it all the way from over there. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So I hope yeah, that's a nice. question. Um, lots of awesome. live. Um, that's how you use a shampoo bar. And the shampoo is actually great for starter locks. I believe, is this, isn't the shampoo bar in our starter lock kit? Absolutely. Actually, I have it up here. I got to tell you something, though. Um, I was using oh, no, we had two. I was using the shampoo bar before I started my locks. Mm -hmm. I was using it on my natural hair. Um, I like the conditioning bars as well on my natural, like, just without the locks. I love how it made my puffs, like my little Afro puffs and mm -hmm. stuff I used to wear. It softened the hair a lot. And the smell is awesome. But I had the lemon and um, the chamomile one. Yeah, I like that one too. Lemon and chamomile is this is what I was using together. The shampoo together. bars are super awesome. clutch. Awesome. So definitely check those out. Um, the starter lock kit that we do have on our website is rose water, um, the black charcoal shampoo, because it's not too drying, but it gets out whatever you need to get out, our conditioning oil, and our pomade. That's our starter lock kit. However, you can kind of remix it how you want to get whatever one, you know, you, the healthy root so great. I think I have that one here on Amazon. It has, it has a bar. Yes, the healthy root kit has a bar. Yeah, here it is on Amazon. If you're on Amazon, I just highlighted that one. That one comes with a shampoo bar, rose water, conditioning oil, and we can't forget your lock towel. We cannot forget your lock towel because when you start your locks, I highly recommend a lock towel just because one, it's going to absorb all that water and it's not going to leave any lint in your hair. Um, and let's talk about lint. Because in your starter lock stage, your hair just going to want to do anything it wants to do. Now, Serema, I know you mentioned you use a little bit of product, which I was to highlight that she didn't say she used a pound of gel or half a bottle of refresher spray. No. Minimum product. Minimum product, and you're still going to get these same amazing um, results. A lot of the time, we guys, stre we stress over here, minimal product. You don't use... You Need to use half a bottle of pomade to do a retwist yeah, just a little at bit. all. Just a little bit goes a long way. So she's using minimal product. It doesn't have any buildup. And so that's why she can go a little bit longer for her wash days. But look at this one. <laughs> what, I'm telling you, this is what I would tap my edges with. Tap it with that. Believe I I love that comment. It says, a lock journey truly is a mindful practice of self-care. Nice. Ooh. Let's get that. Yeah, Write, that Write that down. Write that down. Write that down. down. <laughs> yeah. That's everything. That is so true. Like, and that's one of the things I always say too, like with a mindful practice. Oh, sorry, hold on. A lot of journey truly is a mindful practice of self-care. One of the things that I, I always want to stress to you guys, a lot of us get locked because we don't want to do a lot of work, right? Right. We don't care to do a lot of work. We don't care to do a lot of self-maintenance. So what we're saying is not to spend three hours maintaining your hair. We're not about that life, period. Mm -mm. We're saying just have a simple routine. It could be five minutes a day, um, but you just need to put that in there so your hair can keep, like, snap, snap. April says snap, snap. Your hair can just keep doing its thing, right? So I want to get back to routine. One of the things that Serena has been doing to make sure there's no lint um, at 
as well because she's in that starter stage. It's going to attract all kind of things. And if it gets stuck in there, it's going to be a little bit, it's not going to get all the way into your locks, but just prevent it. So what has been the key thing that you're doing to um, prevent lint? My head, my do-rags, my, I sleep with my do-rags. Um, I can't brush yet, but I do sleep. I can sleep with my hair covered all the time. I've got, I have the black chain do rag, and I love that. It's one of my favorite ones. The dream of the dream of red is a stretchy one. I didn't know it was made out of stretchy material until I opened it and put it on, and I love it. It stays on my head throughout the night because I'm not. And um, it's in my head all night. Um, We're trying to find this starter lock one so you guys can see it. Yeah, one in there. We actually need it because it was in there. I thought you had one in there. But um, that's what I sleep with every night. No, that's a sock. I um, you like the black chain one? You said I. It's the you could get the um the the you could get the do rags like this was the first one I had, and the um stretchy ones are pretty good. But um, that's what I sleep with every night. Um, I even walk around the house with them on. But um, I don't ever let my hair out unless I'm going outside. When I up, I don't have any problems with the lint because I keep my hair covered when I'm in the house. So no pillow, no hair, no clothing, lint, no nothing on my hair. It is pretty clean. Though. She was showing it to me today, and I've, I haven't really paid any mind looking at my hair. I'm sorry. I haven't paid any mind really looking at my hair. And when she was showing it to me today, I was like, really? It really is clean. Okay, this is my favorite one, and I love this one. It's uh, the black chain. It's the starter lock do rag. In case anybody's been wondering how you wear these, I'm gonna put it on for you. But I gotta tell you, the material that this is made out of, this is an awesome. This is one of my favorites. But I gotta tell you, the indigo and the Rima the Dreamer red and the <laughs> black paisley blue one are all made out of a spandex stretchy material, and it will fit the biggest head. <laughs> In the longest locks, but they're really convenient. So this is your starter lock do rag. I don't know how many. Well, I do know how many of you order these, but um, this is it. You always start your. I would hold it like this if you didn't know how to put it on, and you stick it on your head like this, and I just stick it all up under there. And as you know, it has the the snatch back right there. I take that and put it. Pull it down over my hair. And then I feel one out. I feel one out. It's not in. Okay, there we go. And I take this ties and we tie it down. And voila. I'm ready for my night of sleep in about another hour. I'm out. <laughs> but this is it. And this is how I am all night and until I leave my house. And convenient, don't slip off. It's not going to bother my edges, which was thinning until I started using my. Love that stuff. And that's it. I love it. It looks cute, too. I know, right? I can't fit my hair, though. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> right? But that's my sock, my do-rag. And I will tell you, like I said, this is the silky one. These, this one, the blue chain, but the black paisley blue, indigo red, indigo, and the Rima the Dream of the Red are more stretchy. She you. just wanted to say Rima Roll the Dream <laughs> She got it. And all of our bonnets and hair pieces <laughs> are named after our customers. So we have an Aisha piece. Like they're all named after our customers. So definitely check them out and wait. Just put them in your car because I have a special announcement for you guys. Just put them in your car, whatever you like. Um, I'm going to show them how to style your locks, right? The starter locks, because I know, like I said, Serena can wear her locks like this at work, but I know not all of us can. Um, so I definitely want to show, show you some creative ways that you can wear your locks. Um, I think Malcolm um, asked a question about the palm pomade. So I'm going to show you re real quick, Malcolm. So what all does the pomade do for the edges? So a lot of people, Malcolm, <laughs> a lot of us, you know, <laughs> females, we like to like snatch our edges. 
lay them down to the gods. We like them not to show. Um, we like them to just lay and curl and all kind of fancy stuff. And so our pomade will do that, but it won't leave any residue. Um, so I'm going to show you. I will say it doesn't snatch your edges to the fact that it don't move, like, because it's not, it's build up free. So it's not going to do that. So you just have to use a little bit just like that. You do get a complimentary brush for any of our kits. You get a lot brush. Um, so you put a little bit. And I put some of my hair Sunday. So I'm going to show you guys just like, just like that. See that, Malcolm? Can you see that, Malcolm? you just brushing your edges like this. Now, I don't really care, but I'm not the edge girl like some of y'all. Like, but you see, it lay your edges down. And then the nighttime, you pick that up. And it'll, you get up in the morning, it looks like brand new. One of the cheat codes I use is when I don't do a full retwist, I just retwist my front of my ear with a pomade and it makes me look like I have a brand new retwist. So it's really excellent for that. Especially like Sarima mentioned, I think you did mention that like you do, you only use a pomade on your edges mm -hmm. to kind of give it that like refresh look. So definitely um, do that. And retwist. Hmm? Retwist with it. Okay. And you can also retwist with it, um, Malcolm. You can retwist with it. And it looks good with the retwist. Yeah, it does me. look great with the retwist. Um, and we could do one quick demo for you guys before. I, I'll Well, I'm going to style her here, and I'll do a demo. So one of the things that I absolutely love for starter locks is our headband. So like this headband, I'm going to let you put it on before I try to put it on and choke you. <laughs> so you can just you can wear it either... You could wear it this front way. or the back. So we're gonna cute way to style this. You can wear it like that, like this, right? So what this is doing, this style is again holding down your edges, protecting this part of your hair, but then you still can let it hang because you know I, I know y'all want this lock to touch your shoulder. And it will eventually. It's like touching my ankle. <laughs> it's on my back. It's on my back. It's on Just back. ask Lee. This is how Lee walks around the office. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, baby. It's fine. You gain. You gain your lock. <laughs> your locks to your chin, to your neck. So this is it. Like I like that. You know, you can still leave some lock out, but also if she wants to just completely protect her edges. It will protect it. It's not tight on her hair. Um, and it's super cute. We have these in different patterns. So put that in your cart. Uh, how long do you re recommend leaving the hair before retwist? Um, Stacy asked that question. Retwist is very optional, right? Um, you can retwist your hair, I would say, as often as every two to three weeks. Um, I like to retwist my hair every two months just because it allows my hair to grow and do its thing and thrive. However, if you're not doing a fresh retwist all the time, you can still wash your hair. So a lot of people feel like you can't wash your hair and not do a retwist. You have to do a retwist right after. That's not true. What you want to do, including in your routine, Stacey, is this. So one of the things Sarima is doing because she's allowing her hair to just do its thing, she's taking fingers before she um, refreshes her hair with fresh hair, and she glides it through her hair like this, just like this. What that's going to do is a lot not is going to prevent her roots from locking together, from combining like this. So if she's like, you know what, I, unless she wants free form locks, that's fine, but that's not so she's just going to take her fingers and she is going to gently go through her roots at every day before she refreshes. And that's just going to make sure her roots from locking together. Don't want to wait till wash day to do that because then that's when you're like this. You're pulling your hair apart because you allowed it to start locking together. So that's my only advice for you, Stacey. If you do the hairs and literally, literally just doing this, it's not big of a deal. And you do just everything. So if you go back to some of my videos, I would have like an inch of new growth, but they're not locking together because I'm doing this every day. So just make sure you're doing that. So that headband, I highly recommend for just like a quick style. Of course, we have like our ready tied wraps. I don't know all be able to put on this thing in a wonderful I don't want to embarrass you upon life, which is <laughs> hard to do. So with our, these are super cute. 
right? Starter locks, you can actually fit everything under it, like all your hair under, but then it is, and you're super stretchy, everything under, but then it still gives you that illusion of like cute, fab, like with a bow, like she actually spent time creating like a nice bow in the morning. She ain't, we just saw how she did it. So these are <laughs> super cute and they come in different colors as well. You are so welcome. Yes, Stacy, we have two Stacy here tonight. <laughs> so I'm gonna say Stacy, I'm talking to you girl. Look at the regulars, they like, wait, there's another Stacy. Um, <laughs> when adding the color wax, do the hair needs to be washed? No, Robertson. And we have a video, check out on my reels, check out on my IGTV, I actually have a video of me putting it on. But no, your hair does not need to be wet to put on the wax. This is cute. Um, she said that confidence. <laughs> Uh, Aisha said that confidence. Girl, this is cute. I right? never worn one. I don't like this. Okay, don't get too comfortable. She's oh, modeling my pieces. <laughs> <laughs> she was getting too comfortable. Like, listen, don't. I got a warehouse full of this stuff. Okay, <laughs> now, you know, start a lot phase and Boo Boo decides he want to take you out on a date. And you're like, ooh, I want to look fabulous. I want to look special. Sparkly, then we got some for you too. All right, put this by and be good. You want to the front? Well, the front. Jesus, what the heck is this? All right, you can't wear this to oh, church. This is, huh? Well, no, we know you're wearing this. No, we don't wear this to the set. <laughs> what set you going to? The world shut down. <laughs> the world. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be setting in my living room. This right one now. would be super cute with some big old gold hoops some big old gold hoops, but look, it gives you that nice little fancy dancy sparkly gear. So you can wear it to the church. Even if you're going to virtual church, like put it on, <laughs> nobody knows. Um, and look how cute Nobody's you look. gonna know. <laughs> look, how <laughs> <laughs> look how cute she looks. This and is looking cute. good, Rima. Okay, take it out before you start like it. <sighs> then, if you wanna be careful, put it out, put it out. <laughs> If you want to be a hot girl summer, oh, this one is also having like a cute little bow piece. It's a two color duo is and this cute. is all satin. And notice the pieces that I'm putting on, they're special materials. They're not going to leave any lint in your hair. So this one I love. This is like my hot girl summer wear. Can you hold the front for your big head? Thank you, ma'am. You talking about my big head. We talking about my big head. You can leave some of your hair out. Like some of you guys like to leave like the front piece out, but you can tuck it all in if you just want to like protect it. Um, so she works like a lot of the times in the warehouse and serum is always covering her hair. And Lee be so mad at her. She'd be like, let your locks <laughs> loose. Let it loose. But oh. if she wanted to cover her crown and still look cute, this is like a nice piece. I'm giving you some ideas, right? Because you ain't know these are so cute. Um, I ain't really look at these, but I like this one. But these are super cute, stylish. And again, you can just go on with it and you can leave some of your hair out in the back or you. Oh, what is. Oh, I'm checking myself out. What the fuck? She's teaching it by Asia Center. Us. <laughs> give, me, give me my sitting. Give me my sitting. All right. So this one is this one is very good. This Ooh. one is popular. This is the yeah, you sell a lot of these. <laughs> nah, this I know what this one look like. Look like I got this. This up. one <laughs> This one is cute. For sure. So this one, you could tuck this part in. This one is again like a pre-tied piece. Look at your head so big, girl. Listen. You must have breathed. You like me big head. You like me big head. So you just fix it like that, right? This has like a pre-tied rope. So again, it gives you like cute, diverse that look. It is adorable. Why is she feeling herself so much today, y'all? Like, I can't. But this is cute. <laughs> again, turn to the side. Look, you have so much room. Look, you, right? Come over here. Come here, come look, here, come you here. you got so much room that you can like your hair can grow in it right look at this one can you can they see you on the camera you so short y'all see Tawana <laughs> she's wearing the gray version I feel like we're on HSN or something she's wearing the gray version super oh, cute oh right we doing the HSN ad <laughs> <laughs> she's doing the gray so they're are so many cute ways. So as you can see, my biggest protection style or just something you can rock while you're in that starter lock phase and you may be like 
some of y'all say the ugly stage. I don't think no part of your lock journey is ugly because you learn literally so much. Um, but if you're going through that stage and you want to keep it cute, just throw on one of these hats or some type of protective style. You can do um, like the, the head wraps. We have the satin head wraps. We have the jersey head wraps that you can mm -hmm. do some super duper cute style with. Nice. And nobody's going to know what's under there if that's what you want to do. So, all right. Y'all getting really too comfortable nobody's in my head know. wraps. Girl, you better hope that's there when you come in the morning now. See? They're going to be locked up. Look <laughs> I got all my hair wraps. They're going to be really locked did up. put them in a really now? Yes. And so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to give her a cute style. What's the time? What's the time? It's time to give me a cute style. Let's go. Let's go. We got 15 minutes. Give me a cute style. So I'm going to use our lock towel. You can use our lock towel not only to dry your want to protect, you know, your clothing while you're, you're styling your hair. Also good. Jesus. You this smell like shea butter. with me, y'all. Like, what is this? It just I'm to? like, I can smell it. <laughs> um, do you need to use a conditioner if you use a two-in-one shampoo conditioner? You do not. Um, it is a two-in-one. <laughs> it's a two-in-one. You do not need to follow up with a, a conditioner. Um, just follow up with, like, refresher spray after, and you're perfectly fine to go. All right, so I'm gonna just like freestyle a look on her. I haven't planned anything out. Would you like um, me to go lower? Am I good? You're good. Okay. Um, so what I would is our refresh spray, right? So you're gonna moisturize. When you use our refresh spray, you're moisturizing your crown, right? Again, a little bit goes a long way. You're welcome. So I'm just gonna lightly mist her hair, right? And notice y'all, like we, I like to do stuff so you guys can know that you can do it too, right? So simple. And then you just rub it in. Look at this one, this one is so, it's you like, want to that one right there. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna do, do what I wanna do. <laughs> I'm gonna name it. them. Okay, Pinky and Brain in the Bay. I just leave them and let them rock. I'll be like, just gonna on. add some oil. So she's been really consistent with the growth oil. So I'm gonna lend her some of mine. Yes. She's been very consistent. Well, you know, because I was having an alopecia thing, glad my and look at that, look at that. This was completely. I want you guys to know this was completely skin. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Y'all, she said it after day two of using it. <laughs> I remember her starting. She was like, "I was mad." Never gonna forget and that. And look at my edge. I was like, "Girl," <laughs> and I put it in my hair. Was like, "Oh, boom! Look." <laughs> but they came in. So I love to do like a good two, um, two style, what I call flat. So look at Tawana looking like, what's she about to do to her hair? That's what I want so, to know, Tawana, because it's not much. Malcolm hair. wanted me to show him the pomade. So I'm going to show you real quick, Malcolm. There you go. There you go. It smells like food, Malcolm. A little bit. It smells like you can eat it. Sorry, my do not eat. Do I'm not. Do not ingest. Do not ingest. <laughs> But it smells like you could actually eat it. None of the products. Don't eat none of the products. Don't, don't do it. Like, don't just go real food. And don't feed it to you. Who's feeding it to the animals? <laughs> 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 the animal drink that liquor or something. <laughs> so as I'm styling it, I'm just going to make sure all the loose locks goes back in the right designated please. And I should have bought my pants, but I'm just going to hold it down. A pants? Pin gal. Pin. Oh, I'm like, who? We had to do it punch like, tonight. Look at her over there. God. What you doing, Lee? So, if you're doing like a style at home, you're maybe too short as a stalker to do like a two song twist and then sticking out and maybe looking weird to you. So you can always do like a flat twist going backwards, right? That will help protect your hair, oh. especially. If Nice to Especially if it's shot. Stop moving, man. I said someone want to go to the salon. I want to just move up in the rat today. I was just doing. So I'm just going to make sure the front is nicely done. This is what I'll be doing to Lee's here, y'all. And I just kind of secure it based on the length. And then I just like go. I don't know if y'all can see me clearly. As I'm going, I'm just like twisting it to the other one. Also, kind of making sure they're separate so they're not going to start lock locking together. 
You have no fear, man, in a ball. I think really? you ball ball. Yeah, I am. <laughs> I think the girl did ball. But she not too ball. Really? And if you're new to the channel, I'm a hundred percent Jamaican. And so from time to time, you'll hear the accent change. <laughs> and you may just have to ask for translation in the conversation. <laughs> I was getting ready to say, nobody, nobody on there understood nothing you said. They do understand me. If you understood cool, like what I Stacey, just said. Stacy, maybe. Stacy, Stacy, a yard girl, right? everybody understand me. Stacy, you're a yard girl. I stop talking. Mm. If you understand me, put it in the comment section. Say you understand. Put it in the comment section. Say you understand. No, say I'm a <laughs> and you don't have to be yard if you understand me. And stop move up your head, even though you never move it. But your hair is acting like you want to be pinky in the brain. So I'm it just is. twisting, going back. All right. <laughs> See, look, everybody and their mother understand. Go ahead, man. They all understand? They all understand me. <laughs> Haters will be like, they don't understand the camera. You may need to switch it up. Ah, no, nobody never said that to you, did they? One time somebody did tell me that online. She said, oh my God, you sound better when you talk American. And I was like, my girl, come off on my Ross live. Hey, hey, I, hey. <laughs> I did not say that. <laughs> and it says, I'm like, ma'am, there's a lot of other places you could be. You don't have to be. You know, <laughs> y'all see what I'm trying over here, right? It's gonna look cute. Oh, live! Look at this show. What the heck you doing, girl? <laughs> she like we're live on Amazon too. We forgot that we're live on Amazon. Hi, Amazon. Man, I put. On the Amazon. Okay, y'all. We getting there. We getting there. Lord, Lord. <laughs> Look, zoom in so they can see. Y'all see, y'all see. Okay, y'all better see. <laughs> she snatched me back. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm going to get to the end. Do I have a rubber band when I get to the end? You need a rubber band for the end? I may or I may Damn. need to braid it. Not this here. Well, you know what? I'm you surprised. My hair has surprised me as I got older. I ain't going to lie. And also, y'all, as I'm styling it, I'm not doing it very tight. No, you don't want to do your hair tight. You'd have been squirming by now if I was. But you don't want to pull too much on your hair. You know, you want to attempt, but, you know, a cute mm -hmm. do. Don't pull it like, your hair. That's cute enough to, like, get you from point A to B. <laughs> I want them to now. What are you doing? And then you can two. also put some lock. Why you don't have no lock jewelry in your hair? We got to get you. Right there um, I don't have any lock jewelry in my hair yet. I haven't gotten any. If you Why like, you if you like, if you like to give me some, <laughs> <laughs> right? No, but if I, I can't just take the lock, Julie. That's called stealing. I have to buy it. Everything else. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. I saw, I saw that. that. What's the time? What's the time? I'm trying to hurry, but y'all did this blobbering about seven minutes. Seven minutes. We can do it. She came on five hundred of them. All right, we could do it. We could do it. We could do it all night. Oh, yeah. I like a this. nice cold Stella. What? <laughs> You're unlocked. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Yo, I cannot. <laughs> Yo, this is what I go through every day. The shenanigans. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, mm -hmm. there we there. We are there. So I'm gonna try to braid it since I don't have a rubber band. I'm real cute. Y'all see my style. Y'all ain't know I got talent. Y'all better y'all better put some respect on my name. Okay, I'm gonna tell you this much. I don't really care for like braids and stuff in my head hurts, but that doesn't feel bad at all. Because I didn't do it tight. That's the name of the that's name. pretty Look. cool. Y'all see that? Ooh, you should go. You, you should go. See that? She should Ooh. go braid on Church Avenue. But they're killing you. Yo, <laughs> they're pulling your brains out. Did you say on Church Avenue? Yeah, they're pulling you. your brains out. They hit the African braid up. Oh, 
Yes, Lydia. Somebody tell me that. See, everybody said them can understand me. Look at that. They said everybody. Can understand you? They, they lie. Understand they me. lie. Tracy <laughs> says she from Saint Vincent, Saint Vincent and her friend. Hey, big up hey. That's my ears. <laughs> <laughs> um, who else said that must be on season? Lot of God, <laughs> not on season. Woo. -wee. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Y'all see? You see? All right. All right, turn around the next part of your head. All right, so while we're doing the next part of the head, mm -hmm. I have a special deal for you, right? Mm -hmm. So the deal, the deal what's for tonight. What? Wait, what's the deal? Oh, I'm together, man. Let me go look what the deal is. Hold on. Let me see what Tawada said. Me. The deal is 50% off from today. Are we extending it to the weekend? Sure. They're going to extend it to the weekend. So from today to the weekend, 50% off all headwear. I'll be right back. My <laughs> Sit your foot down. No dad hats. I'm going to get mine before the... No, no every time no you hats. do that... No hats. No hats. Just, the, just the bonnets and all the pieces yeah. I showed you. Every time you. she does that, it's empty. The shelf empty. So I said, let me go run and get mine now. <laughs> you got to wait like everybody else. You uh -huh. sold out. You got to wait. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 50%. So all you have to use is code bonnet50. Can somebody type that in the comment section for me on Instagram, please? Bonnet50. Use code bonnet50 to save. On all the bonnets? On all the bonnets. If you're on Amazon watching, sorry, this deal is not for you, but I have a deal coming up for you guys next week if you're on amazon have a deal coming up for you next week but be sure to throw something in your cart um, based on all the stuff that we talked about that can help you on your lot journey um, and feel free to follow us here on amazon if you have any question and amazon we're going to sign out of you early so we'll see you next week on amazon um yes amazon will have a deal for next week don't worry bye amazon bye amazon Okay. I have to be a little bit, you know, professional. <laughs> so we turned up now. <laughs> Tawana was back here trying to be like, listen, y'all. Y'all trying to keep us in tune. <laughs> it's, it's, it Ma'am, you're on the perfect Amazon. You cannot act like this, Tara. Okay. So now we turned up. Amazon is off. Okay. We turned up. We now on Facebook, YouTube. And my regular Instagram peoples know who I be. Oh, this look cute, man. My body not a gear game business. Nobody can't talk to me. Look at this. Look upon this. Even with a head like Sarima's. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Tiffany, I will miss you. I thought you're water broke, girl. You don't do that to us next time. Be on time, sis. Be that's on time. That's your PR baby? Yes, that's my one of my PR baby. If you guys didn't know, I have, you know, Two babies on the way. I just had one. I just had a PR baby. Gorgeous. Like, a gorgeous. Congratulations, Stacy. Now I'm waiting on Tiffany and Jasmine to pop out my child. And we will be good. Which We're Jasmine? blessed over here. Jasmine. Yes, Jazzy was. Cutie, Jazzy cutie. was me. Yeah, cutie Jazzy. Jazzy. Really? Yes. Oh, I didn't know. I don't be paying attention. Do you remember when Congratulations, I, Jasmine. Do you remember when I prophesied that she was going to be pregnant? You did. I did. But I didn't know that she didn't hit the bingo. Because <laughs> you know, my words don't fall to deaf ears. Hmm. Shoot. How y'all church people play bingo? <laughs> so don't let me say nothing about your womb because you will be pregnant. Not me, but go ahead, Jasmine, girl. <laughs> but I don't just be saying random things. Go ahead, about Jasmine, womb. girl. She got have a cute baby. Baby going to be gorgeous. Yeah. Hey, baby's going to Gorgeous Tiffany. I can't yes, wait for Tiffany. I don't know. Oh, Tiffany's well, Tiffany gonna have a nice chubby wubby. Oh my god, I can't wait to pinch your baby girl. Ooh. Okay, stop Tara. <laughs> <laughs> she said, Oh no, okay. Yeah, let me not say that. She's 19 weeks. We got time. Okay. Yeah, See, I'm so trying to rush the I'm trying to rush the baby out. <laughs> yeah, she'll be here in a few months for Jazzy. Yes. Stacy was early. Yes, Stacy was early. Yeah, Stacy had she Stacy been pregnant, so she should mm -hmm. Oh yo, y'all look at this. I did it. Ah! All right, stand up at them sick. I them can't see the masterpiece. Stand up. Oh, 
Turn. So come see, come make them see the masterpiece when you put our head. Like, just turn. Wait, wait, wait. You got to zoom. Wait, let me take off. Let me take off the towel. Lord Jesus. Like, hold on. Okay. Like, look at this. Nice. Look at that. Turn it. Look at it. Look at that. You see that? See that? It's not tight. It looks cute. Even though she don't have to do a professional look, she still look bad. But good to get a gal, yeah, bad gal, yeah. Oh, who raised these people? <laughs> who raised them? Oh, it looks cute though. Thank you, Tom. And next time, I'm gonna put some jewelry up in there so it looks nice. So she looks, she still looks her age. She's. <laughs> <laughs> Meaning, I did the same style with Lee, but it doesn't make you look like tender. Rosie. How old would you people say I was? Oh, I nobody's am. gonna guess. My birthday's in two weeks, so and we're gonna be turning up. Okay, so wait, the person who guesses her age right, the closest wins a bonnet of your choice. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Y'all got bonnet of my head. choice. <laughs> It's cute. Like, come, so come yeah. on, keep turning so they can keep seeing it. Like, put some respect on my name, y'all. I should just put loctician, Tara the loctician, the master. And none of my family, if you all can guess, because you guys know how old I am. Yeah, no family entering. No family entering. Sorry, B. Sorry, sis. And I know Nini probably there too. So they can't guess. I think somebody got it right. Who Wait, you that? want them to tell you how you how much you're gonna be or how old? No, the whoever. It's the closest to my age that I'm gonna be. Gonna be or now? Yeah, I'm gonna be. Okay, she wants the age that she's put gonna. my glasses on. My all right, my so I'm gonna read glasses. out to you. Tawana fingerprints and stuff all over my glass. Let me see. I can't see Facebook. Let me see. All right. Who's so at 45? Eston. <laughs> okay. So Eston, thank you, baby. Eston's trying to suck up. <laughs> That's all right, Eston, baby. That's all so, right. All right. So nobody on Facebook got it. So Facebook, you're cut off. I'm going to go through IG and pick a winner. So IG says, look at us like two blind people. Whose words music? Like? Tiffany said 52. Hi, Tiff. Cherka says 55. That's my cousin. Miss Jones. Mm -hmm. Um, Stacy, um, Malcolm said forty. Who this? Who this? Who this? Who this? KML consultant said fifty-seven. Jazzy said forty-five, fifty-one, fifty-eight. Who's this? I will see some of y'all out back. I'm telling you right now. Late forties, early fifties. Azerol says fifty-five. Um, Stacy says gonna be fifty-six. Somebody be listening. Those are the ones that's listening. So who who are you gonna give it to? Look, my cousin said. Dang! <laughs> <laughs> Who are you gonna give it to? Pick a winner. Um, it gotta come down again. I saw the person I want to pick it to. But no, no, no. Right after her. Right, go, 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 go. Right there. She's damn. Somebody said fifty-eight. <laughs> <laughs> somebody. I ain't gonna say who. Somebody said fifty-eight. Right here. Who's that? Stacy. She's the first one that got Stacey it. Stacey says on to be 56. Okay, this is my current, but this is what I'm going to be. Yeah, and you asked for that. So, so going to be 56. Stacey, you want a bonnet? D now message us. No, send us an email at admin at peculiaries.com and put in the comment section, locked and loaded winner. Locked and loaded live winner. Put Look, Donnelly said, I'm, I know the answer, but I'm not allowed to play. <laughs> <laughs> so Stacey, you won. Send us an email. Um... Everybody know my age because I done did that stupid video. This is my age. This is my sign. This is what I live. I did it too, but I lied. This is my age. You said 28. This is my sign. <laughs> <laughs> Not 28. Thank Lord. you, Tara. This looks nice. I think I'm trying to rock a little bit. You better put on your uh, your thing now and make sure you come to work like that tomorrow. So that means that you you don't have for my birthday weekend? Huh? I guess. I'm going to New how York. Much, to, how I'm going to do my burnt my hair. Yo, Pammy, where you at? Where you at? It's admin, A D M I I, what is it? A D M I N at peculiarroots.com. Did I say something else? You know, I'll be having 50,000 emails. Admin at peculiarroots.com. Hey, see ya. Thank you, Stacey. Use the code Bonnet50. Put it here, Bonnet50 to save 50% off your bonnet. But Stacey gets the free one, the one that I pick out for you, Stacey. Oh, and, and just for clarity, it's Stacey Edwards, that one. 
That's a whole compliment on there. I don't think that's her real name. Oh, okay. Stacy Edwards one. This is the lady that said I was 58. Girl. <laughs> <laughs> she coming for you. Esten said everybody needs a coworker like Sarima. Esten, dear. He said 45. Esten just trying to kiss butt tonight. <laughs> <laughs> okay, y'all. This was amazing. Good night, usual. everybody. Thank you. We for this. love you guys. This was a new setup for us, so thanks for joining. We can't wait for you guys to actually see us wash here yeah. and do all that fun stuff. We're gonna be crazy. Uh, we gonna get out, but it's gonna be fun. So thanks for joining. I love you guys. If you're new, make sure you hit that follow button on Instagram, Facebook, wherever you're watching us from. Tell a friend about how dope we are. Ask us any questions in the DM. It goes out. It goes down in the DM. So if you're still not sure about something or you were shy i don't know why because we are so loving but if you were you shy and want to ask question ask yeah, us in the dm no, um we love you this was so much fun that i don't want to go but i gotta go so see you guys next time um oh what wait 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 what waiting what waiting list we wait for what you wash with what waiting list what you wash with don't worry about what my waiting list <laughs> Too wild. This good. What waiting list? Remind us what the waiting, waiting list. list? What? Is it the is it the, the the box? What waiting list, honey? Oh, subscribe. Oh, the box. Yeah, the quarterly to, box. To, to subscribe to the quarterly. Oh, box. to subscribe to the quarterly box. Oh, so it's come. It was it, it was supposed to be. We love you week, too, Donnelly. But I'll do it tomorrow. Summer box, yeah. We, it's, it's not gonna be a summer box anymore. It's just gonna be a quarterly box. So this the next one is a fall. box. So I'll I'll have that for you guys tomorrow. Put it put on my to do list, please. Um, we'll have that for you tomorrow, so you guys could get on the wait list. We are looking to. We don't know the amount of boxes we're gonna make, but they're ready. Like, well, we do know I'm lying. Okay, we do know the boxes are. Yeah. Uh, but there's only so much of y'all on our waiting list. I mean, on our regular email list. So we are yeah. doing that. We and it's amazing i'm so excited i can't hide it oh i did say i'm going right i just love you guys so much like i get to do what i love to do every day because of you guys i love y'all y'all are the best y'all are the bomb dot com twerk twerk bye 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 all right bye y'all <laughs> bye facebook